Hello, my name is Kristaps Kalniņš and I'm a Baltic Aviation Academy ATPL integrated student from Latvia. Today I'm in a 737 Classic Simulator and I'm going to show you how a rapid decompression looks like from a pilot's point of view. First I want you to take a look at this panel. Uh, this dial shows us uh, the state of uh, aircraft pressurization. In this dial we have two needles. The smallest needle shows us the cabin altitude, which now shows 6,000 feet. And uh, the tallest needle shows us the differential pressure between the ambient outside pressure outside of the aircraft and the pressure inside of the aircraft, which now shows us 8 psi. Uh, now this is a very important uh, limiting factor, because if the pressure differential would be too big, it could uh, actually damage the aircraft skin. Here on the control panel uh, I can set the flight uh, cruising altitude, which today will be 330, and the landing uh, airfield uh, altitude. It is now set to the automatic uh, state, uh, which means that the system will uh, keep the aircraft pressurized for me automatically. The aircraft's pressurization is achieved by taking a relatively hot and relatively high pressure air from the engine uh, high pressure compressor. It is then uh, cooled down and uh, reduced in pressure and introduced into the cabin in a steady flow. Okay, let's roll and let's see what's happened. Okay, now we are cruising at flight level 330 and we have an auto thrust set uh, to keep constant speed of uh, Mach 0.74. We have decompression. Fasten seat belts. On. Passenger oxygen. On. To inform the cabin crew, I push this pu button, public announcement. After that, I contact the control tower by pushing this button. Altitude 10,000 feet. Engine uh, start switches to continuous. And retard the thrust levers. Now we need to extend the speed brake to increase our rate of descent. And we change our heading for 30 degrees because we are in emergency. We're gonna increase the speed uh, to increase the descent rate. Now to level off, we're going to decrease the speed to 2.50. And now that we are leveled off, we can uh, retract the speed brake. So now we're leveled off at 10,000 feet where everybody can breathe comfortably. Thank you for watching. Uh, my name is Christoph Skalnig and see you on the next videos.